Rob Ashford is a brilliant director. Uh, he brings a great intellectual rigor, energy, joy to rehearsals. He's a very positive energy. Interesting to work with somebody, a, a man who's so steeped in um, uh, a desire to see the good in things, engaging so um, completely with a, a play that uh, has characters stray from uh, a path of goodness into something darker and more evil and satanic and tyrannical. Um, he's brilliant at marshalling uh, large numbers of people. Uh, that, as a part of Shakespeare's design, is, is very key to Macbeth. And Rob met key moments of the play, like the, uh, the disguised army um, assuming the branches of Burnham Wood and moving towards the castle in a uniquely theatrical way. It was a brilliant piece of original staging by Rob. From my point of view, he was a great um, collaborator on the work on the character. We were able to talk in great psychological depth about how we might realize this, this uh, unfathomable human being that Shakespeare creates. Um, and uh, we were both very much in sync about how we wanted to embrace the elemental. So theatrically, we wanted to immerse the audience in rain and blood and mud and sweat and sparks. Alex Kingston is an actress who I saw not long after she graduated from the Royal Academy of Dramatic Art. She was a sensationally beautiful um, and sexy actress and remains both those things. Very intelligent, very passionate. Her experience with Shakespeare really tells. She speaks it with clarity, with naturalism. Um, she has Lady Macbeth's sensuality her um, largeness of soul, largeness of heart, and her capacity to break. And when Lady Macbeth veers to, and maybe over the edge of, of uh, uh, the abyss of madness, uh, it's very heartbreaking. She's a generous performer. She's an exciting performer to watch and to work with because she surprises, but she's also technically incredibly impressive. So the vitality that, that is between the Macbeths is vigorous, very sort of sexually potent, kind of relationship is something that she um, makes an enormous contribution to.